What's up, guys? I'm Shane, and welcome back to the Relegation League. We're going to be taking on Purdue to open up Season 3, and I'm hoping we get our revenge for last season. But first, quick flip through recruiting. Now, I'm really excited for this board, and I hope it works out this year. We got Maurice Allen here. He's an athlete, 92 speed, 89 excel, but 88 man, 83 zone, 82 press, 84 play rec. I need this guy. And again, we don't get it. Giving him the points right now doesn't actually do anything, so we can wait till next week. Uh, we got people who are already on the board. We got Larry Smith, 73 over outside linebacker. We're taking a big lead on him. This guy's a 79 Juco. That's fine. We've only got a few seasons left, so Juco's are perfectly welcome. We just need linebacking help. 74 overall center, if we can get him, sure. 71 wide receiver. I'll take some depth if we can. And Johnny Gandy, I mean, we still need back end help in the cornerbacks. 69 overall, if we can get the other guy. This guy will be like the fourth or fifth stringer for a couple seasons. That's cool. Brad Morris, I was I was hoping for some. We just need a tight end. He'll probably lose his points after this. And then Brian Thurman, just another linebacker. Like, I really just targeted linebackers, and I was trying to go after the secondary. We got a couple other guys. We got Donald Dahl here. Moved him up the board. Some of these guys are going to get points. Because, you know, I'd rather have the 72 out, uh, middle linebacker than the 68 outside. So points will be moved around after this week. Uh, this guy's 79 overall athlete. What are you, though? He's a receiver and a running back. So, I mean, I would take him, but we don't we don't need him. We got other needs. So because we opened with a couple of bye weeks, it was actually funny. We were ranked number 25 without playing a game, and then we dropped out of the top 25 without playing a game. So we're floating right on that fringe, which is good. And hopefully we can start off here with Purdue. Now remember, five years and we're done. This is year three. So you're going to see recruiting become less and less of a factor and more just the on-field product. But this team is pretty solid right now. And again, that offensive rating could actually go up if I was starting the better overall quarterback. But Shelton is a better quarterback for us. Grimes is our kick returner this year. He's pretty fast. And he even broke off a tackle. That was a good return. We just took it out way too deep from the end zone. Pretty solid read option there. 75 was trying to get that block, but we were faster than him. Ooh, that uh, that blitzer got right through. I was like adamant. I just snapped it. I'm like, I'm going to scramble. That guy did not cover anyone. He came right after me. Okay. All right. And man coverage on Brank, but that's when Shelton decided to not be an accurate passer. There we go. And taking Snowden there, getting right through. He's only going to pick up. They give him two, but it's still third and seven. And I don't know if he threw that away or if he missed him, but quick three and out by the defense. Ooh, another broken tackle by Grimes. Takes it up. 19 on the punt return. Okay, we're just going to miss passes all day today. All right, well, that's all right. We got Williams, who should have won the Heisman last year. He'll just take care of it. Who needs to pass? Perfect. Four verts, and just a good scramble, a good downfield block, and... Oh, I was going to step out of bounds. Still barely take a hit. 32-yard rush. All right. Shelton, we'll just get it done on the ground. That's fine. Okay, safety blitz coming. No one on Williams. Accurate pass. There we go. Ooh, great pancake there by 62. And we're in for a touchdown. We're going to take the first lead. He let it fly. I was not touching that controller. Nope. Nope. Knowing my luck, it would have bystander glitched. It would have gotten us for a deep pass again. Nope. Oh, crap. I took a... Well, he's only got four. I took a bad angle and ran into the cornerback who we broke off of. Oh, there we go. Nope. And some sort of flag. I'm guessing a face mask. Yep. Just makes you wonder how things could have been if I didn't take that sack. Crap, I got burned on the counterplay. Oh, my God. Nope. 
This guy just murdered our entire defense. Yep. That was a weird stumble animation. I guess we're just not stopping him today. But luckily, jam cover is where we want to be because our defensive line is the best unit. And he threw it out of the back of the end zone. Ah, uh, okay, they finally got through. I like how it's pass on first down, see how that fails, and just run halfback dive on second down just to make it third and manageable. And a nice run by Williams on a read option. He's going to take that up for 18. There we go. Williams is killing it today. Third and one. I was going to get cute and pass it, but no, we, we just put this in the hands of our running back who has not been stopped today. And it continues that way. There we go. Nice, nice pass to Matheson. All right, this offense is finally moving, which is good because we're almost at the end of the half anyways. Dan Williams makes his first appearance today, only picking up four. Oh, Williams got stopped short, but I'm going to go for this. Three down linemen. Oh, yeah, we got this. Aggressive blocking. No one blocked the linebacker. They just watched that guy coming through. Come on, get him down. Hey, we got a safety out of it, though. I think that's only the second safety I've ever recorded on this channel. End of a low-scoring first half, but we're leading Purdue 9-7. All right, third and three. They went empty for both of the last two plays. I don't know why. And they threw it for two yards. 62 is just laying people out left and right. I don't know if he's going to get credits for pancakes. But he's definitely flattening them. Oh my god, a perfect screen pass. Cut that inside. Uh, of course, there's a flag. Yep. Because we can't have nice things. If I run a good play, it is a clipping call somewhere. That was such a good screen, too. I'm going to do it again. It was not as good a screen. Eh, we still pick up the first. Okay, Shelton. There we go. We're not really getting it done through the air today, but I mean, on the ground, we're unstoppable. No, I know he's... I know he's not that great at tight end, but you still gotta cover him. Damn, they're stuffing us at the goal line, though. Oh, I threw it to Williams, but he uh, he decided to take it out of bounds instead. Matheson wide open, though. All right. Finally get in that end zone. And, hey, technically, two-possession lead. Defense completely stifled him. And Grimes fumbled. You know, I was looking at him like, he's going to fumble this. I knew it before it even hit his hands. Hey, Weber, the extra Juco who we didn't need. He's getting his first career catch. Okay, we're back to halfback dive being broken. And Wynn getting in for a touchdown. Not that we needed another score, but that'll pretty much, that'll seal this one up. And Coach wanted to go for two, so yeah, now that we're definitely going to have this one wrapped up. And scumbag Shane. Yeah, I'd say Williams Jr. dominated today. Final stats on the day. Shelton, 14 to 21, 179 yards, two touchdowns, no picks, only one sack. It was a terrible sack, though. And most of those yards actually came on that final drive. Rushing Williams with 20 attempts, 121 yards, two touchdowns, two broken tackles. No more conservative runs for us. Shelton was 754, and Williams had one for four. Receiving Williams, four catches for 66 yards. Again, most of that in that garbage time last drive. Same thing, Brank at four for 68 and a 39-yarder. That's basically what set up that touchdown. Matheson, three for 29 and a touchdown. Win one for 14 and a touchdown. No stats whatsoever for our offensive line, even though you saw them laying out people. 
Richardson led the team with seven tackles. Snowden right there with five. Fan with the only sack. We had five total TFLs, though. Cochran and Richardson swatting a couple passes. And Snowden was the one who got the safety. All right, off to a great start. Let's see if we can keep this momentum going. All right, so we jump forward a week, looking at recruiting real quick, because we got a bunch of prospects coming in to visit. And uh, Maurice Allen, why you got to break my heart like this? I'm still going to go after him. I don't care. I don't care. He can get all the points. I don't care. Otherwise, Larry Smith, decent lead. Henderson, I'm going to drop him down to 200 points. Cook, we've got such a big lead on. I'm not even going to offer him points anymore. There's no point. This guy, for some reason, Michigan State is going to fight us for him. That's cute. And as far as the other prospects, I am going to go after the 72 overall middle linebacker. Might as well go for more. 76 overall tackle. Sure, we could use one. And Donald Dahl, I mean, 70 overall cornerback. At least we'll have a future. We'll have some decent prospects at cornerback if we can't get the other guy. I just can't believe I can't find a single cornerback. Battle of the Wagon Wheel. This is starting to become an unfair fight, but I need these recruits. We've only got two points in the Royal Treatment. Uh, we are very close to an upgrade. I think we're going to get that. So we'll have all three, hopefully, and have that maxed out. And um, I don't know. Let's not overlook these golden flashes. Ooh, Grimes with a really good return. Unfortunately, there's definitely going to be one or two clipping calls on that. Yep. I'm getting one, like, every drive. I got a couple I didn't even tell you guys about last time. I just cut them out. We've got the center and the wide receiver coming in to visit on offense. Not that I'm incredibly worried about impressing them, but, you know, 100 yards on the ground, 250 passing. That'd be nice. There we go. Wind ran up. Can I cut it through? No. Nope. Okay. Well, I tried. There. Oh, nice one-hander by Brank. He's got some pretty good hands. He made an incredible catch in garbage time last game, too. And Williams can't be denied. In for a touchdown. All right. Defense has him on a third and seven. Just real quick, a failed running play and a one yard out. And the throw in the run just wasn't there. He had someone and just missed him. Good stop defense. They love blitzing on this and just leaving Brank open. Like, this was dangerous last year with Ignatovich. Brank, for some reason, is completely breaking this play. Okay. That looks like a clipping call. They didn't call it, though. Definitely tripped that cornerback up, so we managed to take that in for a touchdown. That is a quick two-possession lead. Another three and out for the defense. Nice reception by Williams. Get these pass yards out of the way early. Nope. Shelton breaking a tackle, stepping out of bounds. Okay, wait, I see that safety blitz coming, and I'm still trying to get Williams a Heisman this year. Yep. Ah, oh, taken down right at the goal line. That's all right. He got in for the touchdown anyways. The best is they're coming out with these three linebacker sets, and it's like, no, I can exploit that. Because now you're all dropped in a... Oh, my God, our one's gone. Screw it, yellow ball. Whatever. I should have thrown that like five seconds before. Yeah, they keep coming out of these three linebacker sets. It's like, eh, this time I'll run it. But usually it's like, that's just an easy pass. There, Grimes got his catch that time. And another one. Yeah, I'll take the easy running yards. We're already at 90 yards on the ground, and I'm trying to pass the ball right now. Shelton didn't have much for stats last ep or last game, but uh, this time he's making up for it. They have seven total yards today. Jeez. And Brank open. I think Brank might end up being better than Ignatovich. Blasphemy, I know. Oh, they got a little drive going now. There they go. They got some points. 
it's another one of those things where if we just keep scoring so quickly, eventually they'll get in the end zone. I don't know what this defense you're playing is, but I like it. Put win on a slant. Or uh, not a slant. Put win on a streak. Take the easy yards to Williams. That's an easy 16. Oh, no. The pressure got there. Our second in completion of the day. I was about to say, nice, uh, nice little blitz there. That's definitely not a clipping call that time. Easy touchdown. <laughs> Easy touchdown. We're only three yards away from the 250. He's only completed 10 passes. Dang, they put up another score. They actually scored really quick. So quick, in fact, that we actually have plenty of time to put up a score of our own. Grimes has no agility. But uh, that's still a really good return. No one on win? Well, there was someone on win, but he got dusted at the line. I almost feel bad for Kent State. But I don't because I want to impress these recruits. I don't know if we are, though. I don't know if we're impressing the defense at all. Especially now that they've decided to start scoring. Oh, hello, Brank. Hello again, Brank. Another one-hander. He's just showing off now. That's 100 yards for him. Two touchdowns. Shelton, six yards shy of 300. Congratulations on you guys getting 14 points. All right. We won't do it. The worst beatdown... I accidentally played defense. But the worst beatdown we've ever put on a team on this channel is when I beat SMU 90-6 to with North Texas. That was a solid team. Good sack by Bradford. That was a solid team. And that was without the J-Kid sliders. So in some ways, what we're doing here is more impressive. Especially when the defense got into a 4th and 28. They took that sack and then instantly a 10-yard holding penalty. And let's see. You know what? Still haven't. I've never blocked a punt. Or a kick. There's a good run, and there's our 100 rushing yards. We're done. We impressed the recruits. Both the offensive recruits are impressed, and Williams only has 35 yards on the ground. Hello, Matheson. Okay, I'm I'm trying to run the ball now, but this is so easy. Whatever. He can, we'll have Williams with like 40 yards and five touchdowns. How about that? Let's go halfback dive here. Yep, that works. More than 18 this time. The defense is like, you had your fun. We're done now. Oh, this is a mean trick, isn't it? If I run that play, that Brank was breaking, but then turn it into a four verts. Brank's gone. Oh, no. Underthrown. He still caught it, though. You see what I mean? Like, this guy is a wide receiver. It's not even fair. I did not realize, on top of everything else, Akron already had the great halfback, the great left tackle, the great quarterback, who we're not even using... I didn't realize they also had Travis Kelsey on their team. Why did I even need to rebuild them? They're good. They're done. I don't need to touch them. You guys, if you want to do this yourself, just use the new uh, the new rosters and simulate five years, and they'll probably win a natty. You didn't even need me. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm like, I just ran past them. They were coming up towards me, and I went to go truck, and I'm like, or I could just slightly veer to the right it's like oh okay well that was it all right i'm done toying with them i gotta leave for work in like 20 minutes okay even running the ball to kill some clock isn't gonna work there comes the blitz there go my blocks oh they had more awareness downfield this time oh they got me they finally brought enough heat to get to me we're up 56 to 14. We are two of two on third down attempts. Because there just haven't been any. Oh, God. Well, now we're two for three. 56 14, and we're still going to have to punt. Good blitz by those guys. They returned the punt for a touchdown. 
and they have the gall to be going for an onside kick down by 35 points with four minutes left but we have the gall to not be able to recover it i'm firing my special teams coordinator so they go for the onside it's fourth and three and they're punting it i'm very confused by their play selection here Great run by Williams. And I keep forgetting. It's like, oh, wait, he's good now. He's an 88 overall. He can just sort of, like, juke and, like, turn on a dime now because of all these Deshaun Gaddy awards. Did he seriously just go down injured? He just went down injured at the end of that one. The nerve. <laughs> Williams is a power back, and he's juking past people. Oh, Williams is back. Okay, he's fine. And Grimes with the drop. And that's why you're a returner and not a receiver. There we go. Win in for a touchdown. All right. The backups are out here. So this game's officially done. I am so sorry to any Kent State fans out there. And Williams player of the game. Yeah. Five total touchdowns will do it. Final stats on today. Shelton, 18-24, 366 yards, four touchdowns, no picks, but did take two sacks. Rushing Williams with 103 yards on the ground, four touchdowns. Shelton at 53 and a touchdown. Williams at 20 in garbage time. Receiving Williams, 6 for 138 and a touchdown. Brank, 6 for 126, two touchdowns. Win, 3 for 64 and a touchdown. Grimes, 2 for 21 and a drop. Matheson at 1 for 17. Wilson led the team with six tackles. All right, so that's shaping up well. Three TFLs and a sack for Wilson. Fan had another TFL with a sack, so that's the D-line impressed, but I think it was all linebackers. Bradford had a sack and a TFL. Lawson, so no TFLs by the linebackers. Huh. Richardson, Snowden, Swat, and Passes. That'll wrap this one up. I I'll let you guys know what's going on with the recruiting and stuff, how these visits went. But basically, in between episodes, I'm going to go through revamp the entire recruiting board, I think. Because I got a feeling we're going to lose out on a lot of people, and hopefully we sign a couple after this game. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, please be sure to hit like down below. If you want to see more from me, be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell to get it delivered directly to your inbox every single time I upload. Any thoughts, suggestions, whatever you may have, leave it all down in the comment section below. Everything you leave down there, I will always respond to, unless you are the trolliest of trolls. Thank you guys for watching. I'm Shane. I'm out.